Hey everybody, Linus here. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell because we've got some seriously cool stuff to dive into. Today we're talking about ethical hacking, specifically the top 10 tools you can use in Kali Linux for social media security testing. Now before we get started, a super important disclaimer, these tools are for educational purposes only. We're talking about serious stuff here, and you need to use your powers for good, all right? We're all about responsible ethical hacking. So buckle up, grab your favorite beverage, and let's jump right into the world of Kali Linux and social media hacking tools. Trust me, this is going to be fun. First up, we've got the Social Engineering Toolkit, or SET. Now this bad boy is the ultimate playground for anyone interested in the art of social engineering. And trust me, social engineering is as much about technology as it is about psychology. Think of it like this. SET is your toolbox for crafting convincing phishing pages. We're talking about creating websites that look so real even your grandma wouldn't bat an eyelid. But SET isn't just about creating fake login pages. It's a whole ecosystem for running sophisticated social engineering campaigns. You can track who clicks on your phishing links, what information they enter, the whole shebang. It's like having x-ray vision into the minds of unsuspecting users. But here's the thing about social engineering. It's not just about tricking people, it's about understanding how they think. And that's where SET becomes a powerful tool for good. By learning how easy it is to fall for these tactics, you become more aware of the tricks and traps lurking in the digital world. You start to see phishing emails for what they are, clumsy attempts to steal your precious data. So, whether you're a seasoned ethical hacker or just starting your journey, SET is an invaluable tool. It's like that one multi-tool you always carry around. You never know when you might need it. Just remember, with great power comes great responsibility. So use your newfound knowledge for good, my friends. All right, let's talk about the big leagues, the heavy hitter in the world of penetration testing, the Metasploit framework. Think of Metasploit as the Swiss army knife of cybersecurity. It's got everything you need to find vulnerabilities, exploit them, and analyze the aftermath. Metasploit is like a massive library of exploits, payloads, and all sorts of nasty surprises for vulnerable systems. But here's the thing. It's not some black magic voodoo tool. It's a framework, a set of tools that you can use to build your own custom attacks. Now, you might be thinking, Chilenya, this sounds dangerous. And you're right, it can be. But here's the beauty of Metasploit. It's a double-edged sword. In the right hands, it's a powerful tool for cybersecurity professionals to test their defenses and find weaknesses before the bad guys do. Imagine you're a security guard at a bank. Would you rather practice your defense against a simulated robbery or wait for the real deal to go down? Metasploit is like that simulation, allowing you to prepare for the worst-case scenario. So, yeah, Metasploit is powerful, maybe even a little scary. But in the right hands, it's an essential tool for making the digital world a safer place. Just remember, kids, don't try this at home without proper supervision. Ever feel like someone's watching you online? Well, with Wireshark, you can be the one doing the watching. We're talking about deep dive network analysis here, folks. Imagine being able to see every single piece of data that flows through your network. That's Wireshark in a nutshell. It's like having a super powered microscope for your internet traffic. But here's the thing. Wireshark isn't just about snooping on your roommate's questionable browsing habits. It's an essential tool for troubleshooting network issues, identifying security loopholes, and understanding how your network actually works. Think of it like this. Your network is like a highway and Wireshark is the traffic camera capturing every car that passes by. You can see where the traffic jams are, who's speeding, and who's taking the scenic route. But with great power comes great responsibility, right? Wireshark gives you access to a ton of sensitive information, so it's crucial to use it ethically and legally. So if you're ready to put on your detective hat and delve into the world of network analysis, Wireshark is your go-to tool. Just remember, what you see online might surprise you, so be prepared for anything. Chapter 4, John the Ripper, the Password Whisperer. Okay, let's talk passwords, the bane of our digital existence. We all know we need strong, unique passwords, but let's be honest, sometimes we cut corners. Well, John the Ripper is here to show you just how weak those shortcuts can be. This tool is a password-cracking beast using everything from dictionary attacks to brute force to crack those digital codes. 
It's like having a safe cracker on your team, but instead of cracking physical safes, John cracks your passwords. Now, before you panic and start changing all your passwords, remember, John is a tool for good. By using it ethically, you can test the strength of your own passwords and see how vulnerable they are to real-world attacks. Think of it like a stress test for your passwords. You wouldn't want your bridge to collapse under pressure, would you? Same goes for your passwords. John the Ripper is a powerful reminder that password security is no joke. It's a wake-up call to use strong, unique passwords and enable two-factor authentication whenever possible. So let John be your guide to a more secure digital life. Just remember, he's not the bad guy here. He's just trying to help you keep your data safe from those who would do harm. Chapter 5, Hydra the Brute Force Berserker Hold on to your hats, folks, because things are about to get brute forcey. We're talking about Hydra the tool that takes no prisoners when it comes to cracking credentials. Imagine a battering ram, relentlessly pounding against a castle gate. That's Hydra, trying every possible combination until it finds the right one. But Hydra isn't just about brute force. It's surprisingly sophisticated. It can target various services from websites to SSH, trying different username and password combinations until it hits the jackpot. Now I know what you're thinking, this sounds terrifying, and you're right, it is. Brute force attacks are a real threat and Hydra is a stark reminder that weak passwords are an open invitation for hackers. But here's the silver lining. By understanding how tools like Hydra work, we can better protect ourselves. Strong, unique passwords are your first line of defense against brute force attacks. So let Hydra be your cautionary tale. It's a reminder that in the world of cybersecurity, complacency is not an option. Chapter 6. Aircrack Ang, the Wi-Fi Watchdog Let's face it, we live in a Wi-Fi world. We connect to it everywhere, from coffee shops to airports. But how secure are those connections, really? Well, with Aircrack Ang, you can become the Wi-Fi Watchdog, sniffing out vulnerabilities and keeping your connections safe. Think of Aircrack Ang as a Wi-Fi Swiss Army knife. It can capture packets, analyze network traffic, and even crack Wi-Fi passwords. It's like having X-ray vision for your wireless network, but air cracking isn't just about hacking Wi-Fi networks for fun. It's an invaluable tool for network administrators and security professionals to test the security of their own networks. Imagine being able to identify weak points in your Wi-Fi security before someone with malicious intent exploits them. That's the power of air cracking. So, whether you're a network enthusiast or just want to make sure your Wi-Fi is secure, Aircrack Ang is an essential tool in your arsenal. Just remember, with great power comes great responsibility, so use your newfound knowledge for good. Chapter 7, Burp Suite, The Web Vulnerability Hunter All right, let's talk about web applications, those wonderful creations that make our online lives so much easier. But behind those sleek interfaces often lie hidden vulnerabilities just waiting to be exploited. That's where Burp Suite comes in, your trusty sidekick in the fight against web vulnerabilities. Think of Burp Suite as a web vulnerability scanner on steroids. It intercepts your web traffic, analyzes it for weaknesses, and helps you identify potential security flaws before they become major headaches. From cross-site scripting or XSS to SQL injection, Burp Suite can uncover a wide range of vulnerabilities that could leave your website or web application open to attack. It's like having a security consultant built right into your browser. But Burp Suite isn't just for security professionals. Developers can use it to test the security of their code during development, ensuring that vulnerabilities are caught and fixed before they make it to production. So whether you're a security enthusiast, a web developer, or just someone who cares about online security, Burp Suite is an invaluable tool to have in your arsenal. And Chapter 8 Nmap, the network cartographer. Ever wonder what devices are connected to your network or what ports are open on that server you just set up? Well, wonder no more because Nmap is here to map out your network like a digital cartographer. Think of Nmap as a network scanner on steroids. It can scan entire networks, identifying active hosts, open ports, operating systems, and even the services running on those ports. It's like having X-ray vision for your network infrastructure. But Nmap isn't just for network administrators. Security enthusiasts can use it to identify potential vulnerabilities on their home networks or test the security of their own devices. 
Imagine being able to scan your network and instantly see if any devices are running outdated software or have open ports that could be exploited. That's the power of Nmap. So, whether you're a network professional, a security enthusiast, or just curious about what's happening on your network, Nmap is an essential tool to have in your arsenal. Chapter 9. Maltego the Digital Detective Hold on to your detective hats, folks, because things are about to get investigative. We're talking about Maltego, the tool that transforms data into actionable intelligence. Imagine a giant web connecting people, places, and things. That's Maltego. Visually mapping out relationships and connections that would otherwise remain hidden. But Maltego isn't just about pretty pictures. It's a powerful tool for conducting open-source intelligence gathering, fraud investigations, and even penetration testing. Imagine being able to track down a cyber criminal by analyzing their online footprint or uncovering hidden connections between seemingly unrelated entities. That's the power of Maltego. So, whether you're a security professional, a journalist, or just someone who loves connecting the dots, Maltego is an invaluable tool for uncovering the truth. Chapter 10, SQL Map, the SQL Injection Automaton. Let's talk about SQL Injection, one of the most common and potentially devastating web vulnerabilities out there. It's a hacker's dream, allowing them to bypass security measures and gain access to sensitive data. But fear not, because SQL Map is here to automate the process of finding and exploiting SQL Injection vulnerabilities. Think of SQL Map as a robotic SQL injection tester. It automatically sends specially crafted SQL queries to web applications looking for weaknesses that could be exploited. But SQL Map isn't just for finding vulnerabilities, it can also be used to exploit them, retrieving data from the database or even taking control of the web server. Now I know what you're thinking, this sounds dangerous, and you're right, it is. But in the right hands, SQL Map is a valuable tool for penetration testers and security professionals to identify and fix SQL injection vulnerabilities before they can be exploited by malicious actors. So, let SQL Map be your guide to a more secure web. It's a reminder that even the most seemingly secure web applications can have hidden vulnerabilities, and it's our responsibility to find and fix them before they can be exploited. And there you have it, folks, the top 10 social media hacking tools in Kali Linux. We've covered everything from social engineering to password cracking to network scanning. Remember, these tools are incredibly powerful, so it's crucial to use them responsibly and ethically. Now, I want to hear from you. Which tool did you find the most interesting? Have any questions about ethical hacking or cybersecurity? Let me know in the comments below. And while you're down there, hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you don't miss out on any future cybersecurity goodness. Until next time, stay safe, stay ethical, and keep those networks secure.